Welcome back, we got Gunslinger Suicidal Mario 64 Remastered. These runs are taking way less time than I'm used to. They're going by really quickly, so uh, we're going to have to... I don't know, maybe... I don't want to do it yet, because I'm going to be... Well, maybe I should do it? I don't know, because I'm, I'm going to be logging my hours, right? And I'm like, do I want to do that right when I make the move to, to longer games, or do I want to do that before? I mean, I, I probably want to do it like with the longer games right so I don't know we'll uh, we'll have this video and then the next one on uh, on four rounds and then maybe in the uh, in in the in the following week when I log whatever week it ends up being who knows what other excuses I could come up with to avoid doing it but when I when I eventually do it maybe uh, move up to to normal length rounds or perhaps even um, like hell on earth again might be capable of that now. I might I might have uh, reached the the necessary skill level to uh, to do Hell on Earth a little bit more consistently now because it's uh, suicidal feels just I mean for the most part pretty pretty simple honestly. So I mean I'm thinking about maybe moving up to Hell on Earth. That's going to kind of take up Perfect. the time that we need to to consume because they're a little bit short. They're a little bit shorter than I'd like. Which is, uh, which is a problem. I don't like my videos being under 10 minutes long. I like them being about 10 to 12 to maybe even 14 minutes at the highest. For the KF2 series, anyway. You got two of them a day. You know? You got, you got two of them a day. Build them up, watch them whenever you want. Listen to me ramble about the, the least important garbage. So I don't know. We'll uh, we'll see how it goes, but I've got another episode to record after this, and then uh, I've got to make my decision about what we're gonna do. So I will not be able to read your comment before reading the night before uh, before recording tomorrow's episodes. If I do the um, I was thinking I might ask, but this video is going up Tuesday morning, and I'm going to be recording starting. Well, you know, if you read it, if you get on the video, like, way early, I'll be able to, to see your comment before I start recording the, uh, the next week's videos. Um, but if you're, like, two hours late, the videos are going to be recorded, unfortunately. I'm going to have started recording. I'm not going to be checking the, uh, the comments, because i gotta got to log the hours. I can't be taking breaks and messing up the data, you know? But uh, if you're there, like, within the first couple of video within the first couple of hours of uh, this video going live... It's before like 10 a.m. PT, maybe even like 10:30 PT. I don't know, 10 10 PT. Um, I'll probably be able to read a comment or uh, or or two or all of them at that point. Um, so anyway, what would you guys prefer? Would would you like like normal length rounds where the, we do? I think it's seven rounds instead of four. Or would you like uh, Hell on Earth, or do you want? me to continue doing these shorter rounds or I don't even I don't even know yo I don't even know what the right decision to make is it's a, it's a big decision it's not really but it is a decision I have to make to figure out some way to fill up content in these videos anyway because they're they're just way too short now I'm, I'm too good I'm too good to be doing hell uh, suicidal gunslinger runs now I am too good Okay, I say I'm too good, and then I kind of get overwhelmed. But that's that's kind of the joke, is that I'm not too good. But these runs are taking like they're they're going by in record time. You know, they are they are flying by, and uh, we got a we got a it's, a it's a problem. They're too quick, and I uh, I think I have uh, I've overcome. I mean, I've been past the point of suicidal being. Like, I'm not going to say a challenge at all, but past the point of Suicidal being too hard. Like, Suicidal has been consistent wins for quite some time now. Like, I can do Suicidal, like, streaks, right? Like, I can I can win numerous Suicidal games in a row, and that's, that's not a problem, right? Now, I do die on occasion, but, I mean, sometimes you just, you just die. 
You know, sometimes you don't see a stalker and it kills you. It, it, it happens. Nothing you can do about it. Um, but I've been past the point where uh, suicidal has been too hard for us for for a long, long time. It's just that uh, up until now, hell on earth has been too hard, right? So I kind of needed that in-between point between the two, where Suicidal and Hell on Earth kind of meet right right in the middle there. And uh, that kind of in-between difficulty is kind of where my sweet spot was for a while. And I don't know, maybe maybe I've moved up to, uh, to being a confident Hell on Earth player now. As Gunslinger, maybe Demo even, perhaps. I don't know. You know, it's, uh, it's, just, it's strange, because we're like six minutes in here and we're almost... We're almost done with this match. You know, that that's that's kinda just a lot of time. Or not a lot of time, it's very, very quick. Because these guys are gonna I mean, use 40 41, you know, more Zeds to kill. That's 41 more shots, you know, like boom, 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 boom. Right? Now there's 33. Right? It it goes by very, very quickly. Goes by very, very quickly. Fall Guys has been the new kit thing, as far as I'm aware, right? Fall Guys has been pretty popular. I don't particularly get it. You know, some people are super into it. It's been taking the uh, the YouTube scene by storm. It's been uh, kind of taken off pretty good. Good for them, you know. It's, uh, it's a success that you definitely want as a game developer, I'm sure. It's been uh, popping off pretty well as a, as a game. Steam has been recommending it to me, but it doesn't uh, it doesn't feel like my kind of thing. I'm not into the, like, um, the whole Battle Royale type thing anyway. So, you know, it's kind of... Kind of a battle royale, and then that kind of takes it makes makes me not enjoy it quite as much as maybe other people would, because to me battle royales are just not super fun. But then this is kind of a special battle royale too, right? Where it's not super battle royale; it's it's kind of a little bit unique. And uh, I don't know, some people are getting really into it. But the thing that uh, that really gets me about it, and it, it makes me almost want to play it to to see if maybe it would it would affect me too, is people get so negative when they're playing the game, and it's not negative in the same way that. People get negative when they play KF2, where they're like complaining about the game and the game's bad and the developers hate us and blah 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 blah, all this kind of annoying entitled nonsense. It's uh, it's more grounded stuff where they're, well not not really, <laughs> not not really, um, but they'll they'll get like grabbed by somebody and they'll get like just so irrationally mad about it, and uh, you know it's uh, it happens it happens to everybody that I've watched play it. Where um, you know you'll take perfectly reasonable people, and then uh, they'll they'll start getting terribly mad in the game. And you know, obviously, when you're watching streamers or YouTubers, they're putting on an act. Like, you know, they're they're pretending. They're not actually as mad as it uh, as it would seem. But it's still uh, it's still a, a far removed from their their normal behavior, their normal their normal paradigm as a, as a content creator. And uh, it's it's so interesting to see how mad people can get over over seemingly such, such simple things you know because uh, you know they get grabbed or they get pushed off or, or something and they, they, they don't they don't think about it. you know they'll, they'll be in like the enemy's basin of eggs or something and one of their teammates will, will grab them and they'll just they'll get so mad about their teammate grabbing them and I'm like I've seen you do this. You know, you, you hit the wrong button. You're like, oh, sorry about that, man. Like, that was, that's my bad there. Like, it's a, probably just a mistake. Like, you can, you can just laugh about it and move on. But they, uh, they always take it and, uh, and over-exaggerate it, which, uh, I don't, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I would do it too if I got into it, but I feel like I wouldn't. I don't know. And obviously they're not mad about it, but it's just the way that they choose to, to act out the, uh, the experience, for uh, for entertainment's sake, is uh, is so different from from other games that they might do. And it's it's uh, it's true of almost everybody that I've seen play it, where they get so mad about the littlest things in it, 
and I don't, I don't know. There, there's some kind of a psychological phenomenon happening in that, and it's, it's bizarre to me. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.